Insect experts say it's thanks to beekeepers, hard work and dedication, we're not in a crisis. They've had to get creative to keep the bee population steady as many of them die off. <laughs> The buzzing of bees is music to Chris Kempton's ears, but Florida's bee population is in jeopardy. So Kempton has launched a campaign to save the tiny insects. We're in our baby steps right now from humble beginnings. Uh, it started with just one hive rescue, uh, and then I put a little out on Facebook, as you know, and that just went viral. Kempton offers free bee removal. If someone finds a beehive on their property, Kempton will handcraft a new hive, rehabilitate the bees, then relocate the hive to a place willing to host the honey-making creatures. And the bees need the help. Mites, nutrition, queen quality, weather events, they get bacterial diseases, fungal diseases, etc. University of Florida professor Jamie Ellis says Another the beekeepers right efforts are the reason Florida's bee population is staying stable. Beekeepers are doing everything they can to keep those colonies population static so that the bees are available to pollinate the nation's food supply. So they really are the heroes in this story. Kempton says he uses several tools to give the bees a fighting chance. We get them strong, we give them supplements. And include bug traps in the, in to keep hive, other insects right? out of the so hive. The a process Kempton has gone through six times in the last so four months bugs. as he has now relocated several <laughs> hives. If Soon, Kempton and the other hive hosts can compare the fruits of his labor. To learn more about how you can help protect the bees in our area, download our free WFLA app. Reporting in St. Pete, Chloe Sparks, 8 on your side.